Oh man, what's up guys? Welcome back. Explore with Rick with a new one. Thank you everybody for coming back. Greatly appreciate it. So as you may know or don't know, Metro Exodus is one of my favorite games of all times. And uh, I just decided to download the DLC, which is called Two Kernels. So without further ado on that, let's get to that. And let's go ahead and click chapters, two kernels. Let's get it, guys. Again, thank you so much for coming back. I appreciate it. You're so more than welcome to join. If you like my content, go ahead and join. I dare you. No, I'm just kidding. Go ahead and join, guys. I'd love it if you would. Thank you so much for watching. Let's get this, baby. Let's get it. Here we go. Oh, no. My daughter, the year we spent on the road gave me time to think about things. Respect, responsibilities, duties. They all mean nothing compared to what's important. My family, you. I'm sorry, I only got it now. I'll go through this snow-covered graveyard with a sieve if that's what it takes to find the cure. As for Artyom, he feels his guilt. He wants to atone. I'll just have to see that atonement doesn't cost him his life. The important part is that I'm back in Metro, and no mutant can stop me here. Radiation on the surface is different, though. Frankly, I thought I was buying a one-way ticket for myself going in. You said you were close, but why do you need the Institute? You are persistent. We're on a mission. But that's all I can tell. But now, thanks to the green stuff given to us by Kirill, we both have a chance to achieve the goal and survive. So, Private, our team left. I'd better get ready to set out, too. What about me, Colonel, sir? You'll stay here. I'm putting you in charge of communications. I need someone to coordinate the operation. Can you handle the responsibility? Yes, sir. I can. Good. By the way, Private, how did you live here before the riots, when there was still enough green stuff to go around? Uh, we did all right. But my dad was always out on a mission or a patrol. So you barely saw him? Oh, no. Dad did his best to come home earlier, especially on the holidays. We even spent the last New Year's together. Colonel, sir, the maintenance guys asked to remind you to burn all the slime around the pumps once you reach them. Uh oh, I say the slime is done for. Colonel Klebnikov himself is taking up the flamethrower. <laughs> <laughs> Don't jinx it. As for flamethrower, where is it? Here you go, Colonel, sir. Mind you, it's quite heavy. I know. Is it pressurized? It should be, but I'd still check. The handle's on the side. Give it a pump or two if needed. Ah, uh, if you want something done, you have to do it yourself. <laughs> All right, I'm off. Give Slime some hell, too. We'll do just that, sir. We certainly will. Break a leg! Break both! Oh, thanks. Let's see, press MMB. What is MMB? Oh, middle mouse button to light your way and burn nearby targets. All right, you heard the guys. Let's do it. All right, here we go. Burn the shit out of that. Get it, baby. What is that? Oh, shit. Damn. This thing is huge! Older to all groups. I just saw a fully grown worm, so watch out. That's disgusting. Oh, one here. Roger that. Oh. Red two, roger. I knew I, I knew I saw something. Red three, roger that, sir. 
Whoa. So we, I guess we gotta burn all this stuff on the wall. Whoa. Let's go in here. It looks like the radiation's kind of picking up here, which is not a good thing. Burn the toilet. Taco Bell. Nobody's eating Taco Bell tonight. All right, let's get out of here. Look at that. That's horrible looking. <laughs> Guys, you don't know how much I appreciate when you join me on this channel and watch me play. It really means a lot. I remember you guys, if y'all are having any problems, uh, feel free to talk to me. I'm probably one of the nicest guys you'll probably ever talk to. I'm very down to earth, really easy going, and uh, very much an introvert. I hate people. No, I'm just kidding, y'all. <laughs> if you're having problems at home, whatever, I'm here for you. Hit me up on Explore with Rick on Instagram or YouTube. Better yet, leave it down in the comments if you want to talk. You ain't got nobody to talk to? Hey, talk to me. I'm all right. Everybody's got problems, right? Let's talk it out. Whoa, shit. Oh my God. Oh, 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 what is going on? Hurry up, hurry up. Wow. Ouch. Give me back my flamethrower. The hell is these little worms? Oh, got to burn these little things, too. All right. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so that did nothing. I'm guessing we need power here. So let's go find power. Here we go. All right, got a gas can. Uh, what is this? Oh, generator maybe? Yep. Flick it on. Flick it a wrist. Flick it. Flick. Flick it a wrist. Anything back here? No, nothing. I hate that noise. All that squishy noise. Ugh. It's terrible sounds. All right, now we can turn this on, I guess. See all that green stuff in front of my screen? I think that's uh, radiation, I'm pretty sure. Whoa! Shit! Get off of me! Get off of me! All these little damn little leeches and stuff. Wait a minute, did I miss something? No, maybe I didn't. Okay. All right. Which way do I go? Burn that stuff. Oh, 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 oh. Let's reload this thing. Oh, we got to pump it up. Here we go. Probably need a med kit. Let's go ahead and heal ourselves. Let's get another sip of tea, shall we? But first, let's burn this damn thing. You got it. Here we go. Guys, I think we talked about this before in previous episodes, but... Write it down in the comments. I want to know your favorite beverage. Beverage is of all time. What is your favorite beverage of all time? Mine has got to be tea. It used to be coffee, but then I got really sensitive to the shit. I have no idea what happened. I don't know. Just didn't agree with me no more. But I love my tea. My tea is good. The tea is very good. Here we go. Gotta burn those little things. Turn the water off. All right.
Uh, hold on. Let's pop it up. Wait a minute. Come on. Pump it up. All right. Health kit. What else we got back here? Uh, not much. Where do we go? Oh, right here. Burn it. I love burning this stuff. It's fun. Get through. Can we get through? Oh. Those little glowing things, you gotta burn them. Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Got it. Holy shit. G to wipe your visor. All right, I did that. Perfect. Wait, before I go in here, before I go in there, hold on, I get, I saw something here. It's a little door here. Go in there. Ah. Ah, I'm glad I came back here. Oh, shit. Anything back here? Nope, guess not. Oh, wait. A dead body and some goodies. Glad I came back here. I knew I had to come back here for something. This part reminds me so much of Aliens. Like the second one in the series. I don't know if y'all ever saw Aliens, but when Ripley goes through the uh, the alien cave at night, or wait, at the end of the movie, she has a flame gun and she's burning all the eggs and stuff. That's so awesome. And this part kind of reminds me of that, actually. It's got to be heavenly inspired by aliens. For sure. Got to be. No other way around it, right? Hmm. Boom! Oh. oh, boy. Moving on. Got to burn all this stuff. I tell you, this reminds me so much of the movie Aliens. I'm telling you, when she's going in that cave at night, you got all the aliens looking at her, and she's burning all the eggs. Lieutenant Ripley. Yep, that was it. That's what this game reminds me of a little bit. Love it. Any goodies? Yep. Right there. Got it. Whoa, shit. What the hell? How did they get me? Hold up. Red 3, I got a set of pipes here. Can't burn through a barricade. We're gonna need some explosives. Red 3, you don't need explosives. Just find the valve that stops the water flow. Roger that, hold up. Oh, it looks like I get some, uh, flamethrower gun stuff. Good job, Red 3. Oh, shit. Oh, flame gun stuff. Flamethrower ammo. And guys, I just want to thank y'all so much again for joining me. You don't know how much it means to me when y'all watch me play. It means the world. I love it. I know it's hard to believe, but I love it. I love it when I have an audience. Whoa! Oh my god! How in the hell is that hurting me so much? Shit. Oh boy. Come on. Oh. Ah! Get out of here. Wow. Can I go back here? No. Nope. Where do I go? Oh, under here. Oh. Almost missed that. Oh. 
Oh, shit. All right, so we turned the valve off. Guess we gotta burn that. Ah, how convenient. A ladder. Anything else back here? Nothing in that hole? Nothing. All right, good. For Gucci. Kick this door in, because that's just what we do. Burn all that stuff completely. Oh. Damn. Those things don't give up, do they? Son of a bitch. Alright, there's an operating table, it looks like, so I don't... I mean, I kind of need it. Uh, let me... Turn this on real quick. Alright, definitely need to turn it on. Oh, what is going on? Oh! Shit! Damn it! Oh, wait, let me... Yeah, let's check this out first. I'm glad I came back here. I was about to actually ignore this spot. Okay, so, uh, E crafts... Oh, I don't really need any more health kits. Good on that. I got a lot of flame gun ammo, that's for sure. I don't even know if I'm gonna need all that. Oh, let's clean this. Uh, yeah, can we inst... Hold on. The standard one, but doesn't lose air pressure. Can we install that? Wait. Yeah, let's install that. Perfect. And standard tank. Let's install that. Okay, it's done. Let's clean it. And I think we are good to go. Yeah. All right. Um, we're Gucci. Let's go. And probably need a med kit soon. Let's go ahead and pump a med kit. Perfect. Chemicals. Oh, shit. I don't like when that stuff gets on me. Uh, wait, what is this? Nothing. Oh. Damn freaking snakes. Let's crawl under here, it looks like. Can we go? Yep, there we go. Come on. Let's do this, baby. All right. Oh, yeah. And I noticed the monsters in this game, too, especially the snakes. Well, not the monsters in this game, but the snakes that I've been burning. They sound just like the aliens when you burn them with the flamethrower. Amazing. I love it. Burn those little things. Ooh, no, we don't want that in there. <coughs> Ugh. Whoa. 
Make sure you burn those things on the way. Because if you don't burn those little... Uh, those little worms, they, they spit at you. Alright, let's pump it up. And let's replace the cartridge. Yeah, see those little green things over there? Those little glowing things? Whoa! Yeah, you see those little glowing things right there on the ceiling? You gotta make sure you destroy each and every one of those things, because if not, they split venom at you, and it poisons you. So don't get poisoned, right? Hello, sir. How is it going on your side? Oh, hey, how's it going? Yes, pretty much. What's up with you? Oh, my flamer won't hold the pressure. And I can't find a leak for the life of me. Do you have any spare fuel? I didn't expect that shit to grow so thick here. Of course I do, sir. Help yourself. Here. Nice. Thank you. I heard helping the commanding officers is good for your career. Also, that ship did grow like crazy. Ah, I think I got it. <laughs> I really did. All right. I'll go catch up with the guys. Good hunting, sir. Okay, uh, I guess we're free to go here. Alright, I'm gonna let him do his thing. And we're gonna proceed over here. Oh, it oh shit, attention to detail. Watch when I walk under the waterfall. It actually, uh, it actually turns the light out. Well, it burns the flame out. Watch this. Oh man, look at that. I love it. Love it. Attention to detail. Uh oh All right, he's dead. Whoa. All right, they're all dead. Wipe my visor off. Why not, right? Oh, shit. Burn. Having a barbecue here, right? <laughs> I tell you what, I love the story of this game. It's so intense. I love it. I don't know about you, but it's like one of my favorite games of all time. Oh, shit. Burn everything. Gotta pump it up. Make sure we got a full tank here. Uh, I don't want to go there just yet. Whoa, shit. Yep, let's go this way. Let's kick that in. Oh. What's back here? More goodies. Whoa! Shit! Those things are relentless. They just don't die. Shit. Those little squiggly things don't hurt you. Those little bitty worms. But the, the caterpillar looking worms, they hurt you. Oh! Like that thing right there. Watch this. Yep. Figured that. They like to explode. Can I go in? Yep. Don't put your gun down, dude. I'm telling you. Something's bad. Exactly. Something's bad's gonna happen when you put your gun down, baby. Don't need an operating table, not right now. I think we're covered. But thank you for asking. 
Find a whole bunch of goodies right here. Shit. Kick that door down. Alright, this is where I came in at. Sort of. Alright, it looks like the radiation levels might be up in this room, so we're gonna take uh, proper co blah, 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 proper protocol. And uh, I think I actually might have to inject myself with some health here. Oh, shit! Oh, God. Oh, boy. So, uh, say, y'all. So, the point behind this channel, I want to give y'all the greatest quality content possible. I usually upload in 1440p or 4K, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy that. A lot of people like to upload in 1080p. I, You know what? I'll go 1440p or 4K. I'll usually upscale it. Uh, cause I want the best quality content possible for all of my uploads and walkthroughs. And the point behind this channel is doing complete walkthroughs that are really good quality. And if you guys have any, uh, suggestions, just go ahead and leave it in the comments. I would appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right, let's proceed down here. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. I have no idea where we're going. I'm just kind of following the yellow brick road, right? Oh, shit. Let's proceed up. Boom! Oh. oh, I get it. Okay. Um, let me get back here. I think I actually uh, have to turn the water off. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, look at that thing. Gotta burn those. Oh. Oh, shit. Damn it. Let's turn the water off. All right. So we turn the... Oh my god. Look at all of them down there. Holy crap. Oh. Oh. Ah. Damn. Please don't kill me. Oh, they're still floating around in there. All right, he's dead, I think. Oh, look at him. Die already, shit. There's like thousands of them. Feels like I'm not spraying enough or something. You know what I'm saying? No, I can't go in there right now. Oh, shit! Oh, boy. Ah! Get out the way. Holy crap. Oh, dude, that's awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> I love that. on the line. They say the water's flowing again. They are sending a team to handle the rest. 
Alright. But that goes to the other side. Okay, I don't need to go there. I need to go up here, actually. Ah, look what we have here. Can I get out now, please? Where are we at? Oh, look. Sir, we're My boys. Accomplished. At ease, gentlemen. You did a great job there. Thank you, Colonel, sir. Frankly, we were on sweep-up duty after you, sir. Ah, cut that. Sweep-up duty. Sure. <laughs> on behalf of OSCOM, I'm issuing an official commendation. We serve OSCOM. <laughs> Great. Sir, take that suit off and put the flamer down, please. They have to be scrubbed for radiation. You'll also be getting a shot of green stuff at the checkpoint. I'll call them. You just took a week's worth of exposure, at least. Good. Thank you. Right. Here. Thank you, and goodbye, Colonel Sir. Come aboard, Colonel Sir. Thank you. Hey, guys, get aboard. We give you lift to prospect. Thank you, sir, but we're waiting for the transport from HQ. There's enough space for everyone. Good luck, then. Let's go, Petrovich. Yes, sir. HQ here. Zorak Lepnikov, report your situation. Over. Mission accomplished, Comrade General. I'm mostly done, Dolia. The worms are all toast. The guys will have the mop up, and I'm heading home. It's New Year's Eve, after all. Sure thing, Slava. Who else would you turn to for understanding, if not for another single brother? Well, you've got it easy. I hear your son's a captain already. Wow! Give my congratulations to Sirio, You didn't get You can give them yourself. We're planning a little party on January 2nd. Family life. For now, though, just drop by my place and then have your rest. Roger that. Over and out. Bitch, you out. Roll up your sleeve, please. We've got to give you the shot. Here you go. Roll your sleeve up, Petrovich. You get a shot too. Hey, ah, uh, uh, no. Please, I'd rather use my own injector at home. Be my guest then. Thank you. Uh, don't lean on the doors, please. Next station is Krasne Prospect. <laughs> Granddaughter getting worse? No, thank God. Still, standard child's allowance of green stuff is not enough for her, even though we moved to the prospect. So I'm squirreling away whatever I can, just in case. It's not easy, but we survive, and that's what counts. Yeah, but enough about us. <laughs> Tell me if you roasted that shit good. That we did, Petrovich. That we did. Ha! <laughs> uh, my friend, that is good to hear. Still, it will just grow even thicker next time. Like it always does. And see, the pumps are failing. It's because of that slime. They've been working non-stop for 20 years. Ah, and now this shit. The filters get clogged, the O-rings, they burst, the iron rusts. And soon, the old counter-flooding system will give up the ghost, and we'll have to row boats here. <laughs> You'd make a good gondolier. <laughs> I can sing too! Please, spare me. Your singing is an atrocity. Thanks for 
giving me a lift, Petrovich. Happy New Year. Yeah. Same to you. And don't forget, after the official ceremony, we'll be waiting for you and Kirill to drop by, as usual. We'll be there. Man, I tell you what, this game is so immersive. The storyline is unreal. I love it. Love this game. Just like I love you guys. Or y'all. Oh, look, he's sleeping back there. <laughs> oh, look at a rat. Oh, my God. It's a huge rat. Who said that? What are we doing? Hey, what's going on? What's your name tag say? I have no idea. Colonel, sir. Colonel, sir, please proceed. The general is expecting you. Okay, let's go in. I don't need your excuses, Captain. If you take the initiative to do something, you must be ready to see the thing you started to the end. Dismissed. Sir, yes, sir. Hello, sir. Oh, Slava. I've been waiting for you. Come on in. Make yourself comfy. All right, here we go. There's been a new development here while you were out barbecuing. Take a look at these maps. Background radiation? Yes, stalkers brought this in from the SATCOM center. And now, I want your people to go there and find the fresh ones. Detailing the whole country so that we know where to go. Take this under personal control and ensure complete secrecy. Okay? Go, Tolia. Cut to the chase. Are we preparing an evacuation? All right. This is strictly between us, mind you. Yes. We can't delay any longer. We're out of green stuff. We'll have to resort to confiscations, so everything must stay under wraps for now. Why the secrecy? It's good news. People would donate their stock voluntarily if we told them. Not my decision, Slava. Still, sometimes it makes sense to save the good news for last. I see. Thanks for telling me. Remember, it's between us. You know me. Well, Happy New Year! Uh, wait a sec. I better get home now. As a hero of the war on slime and a lone father, you are hereby granted a New Year's present from the command. A one-month allowance for two. <laughs> Thanks. I won't hold you any longer. Unless... How about some tea? Alright, see if we can do that. See, I'm trying to press D, but it won't <sighs> let me. You do know how to keep a man away from his family. <laughs> how is Ser Yoga doing? <laughs> Full of himself, obviously. Just think about it. My son is a captain now. I never raised a finger for that. Can you believe that? Of course I can. That's just typically you. I believe he must achieve everything himself. It builds character. Oh, it definitely does. He used to be on the soft side. Like his mom. He really toughened up now. You were always hard on him. Almost too hard. I could never be like that. Actually, and I speak as someone who's been watching you too, I think you're doing amazingly well. He's growing up a real man! An Oscom fighter. <laughs> yes, he is a huge fan of all things Oscom. We're like superheroes in his eyes. A bit chilling, actually. But we are heroes. We're saving who we can, and it's all for our children's sake. What could be chilling in that? <laughs> he still doesn't understand many things, and idealizes us. Thinks we are knights without fear and beyond reproach, but real life is complicated. You must do certain things. And then look into his eyes thinking, would he understand if I told him about that? And that day will come. Kirill is a real man. He will understand. A real hero, Slava, isn't someone flexing his muscles and wearing shiny armor. A hero is someone who does what needs to be done. He may get splashed with dirt, even blood sometimes, but he still does the thing, because it is necessary. Uh, well, I think I'll get going now. Yes, Slava, I'm sorry I kept you here. Go, go see your son. Give my regards to Kirill and a happy new year. Can I go in here? Nope. Gotta go back. I'll be working on my speech in the meantime. You do that. All right, so we gotta go see the sun. Which is up here, I guess. Colonel, sir. At ease. 
Hello, Colonel, sir. Hey. A happy New Year to you. I guess we gotta go here. Hello, sir. There's too many people in the way. You can't really go through. All right. You'd better go up through the restaurant and get to the you gallery. You filthy drunkard! Just look at yourself, you pig. This game is a is awesome. By the way, it's been a while. Look at this. Looks like hippies made this place. I love it. Do you know the guy? Does that say Slayer? Slayer. Happy New Year, Colonel Ed. Klebnikov. At ease. Same to you, Misha. How about a drink? The first one is on the house tonight. Okay, give me a drink. Uh, tempting, but no thanks. Suit yourself. There's a book here. Look. Oh, here we go. One day we are going to go out. Um, guys, if you want to read that, go ahead and pause it. Side, okay. We are not moles to live out our lives underground, you know. Wait, aren't you dressed yet? After taking so long? The hell? <laughs> Yay, Dad! <laughs> I bet you didn't expect an ambush here. <laughs> <laughs> Great disguise, Private. Though I must ask, where is your sit rep? Oh, the mission of helping prepare the celebration is almost accomplished. There is just one light bulb remaining, sir. At ease, Private. I'll help. Happy New Year, Dad. I didn't think you'd make it in time. You were late for my birthday. And Mom's anniversary, too. You see? I was just doing my best to make sure there were as few sad anniversaries in other families as possible. Oh, I understand. Good to hear that. Now, turn it on. Mission accomplished. Good job, Private. Thank you. Oh, Dad, I have something for you. Here, Petrovich helped me fix it. Oh, thank you, son. Speaking of Petrovich, as soon as the official celebration is over, all personnel are to wash their faces and arrive at Petrovich's place wearing dress uniform. Yay! Arrive at Petrovich's clean face and dress uniform. Roger that, Corona, sir. Wow, the tree is so beautiful. Yes, listen. Dear citizens of Krasny Prospect and our guests from other stations. Year 2034 is almost over. It wasn't an easy year, but all the hardship only served to make us close our ranks around our common goal. The well-being of everyone living down here in the tunnels. We are all looking forward to the coming year, expecting change for the better and it is sure to arrive to our concerted effort as a community. On behalf of OSCOM leadership, I thank you all for your good work and wish you a Happy New Year! Happy 2035! 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one! Happy New Year! Oh, damn! This sucks! The damn generator is out again. Kirill, Miller here. Comms check. Do you read me? Over. Reading you loud and clear, Colonel. Over. Kirill, I'm at the trading stores. Where is that passage to Sibirskaya? It's downstairs. Oscom HQ used to be there. They brought the green substitute from the people there. I see. Confiscations. Found it! Thank you, Private. Sir, 
Citizens, we urge you to remain calm. Voluntarily submit your stocks of radio protector to the authority. Remember, our common duty is to stand together and ensure the common good of all the citizenry. May I, General? Sir? Not funny, Slava, and I'm not in the mood for jokes. What's up at Sibirskaya? We're all done there, and this is what we got. It's not much. This is bad. We're in the middle of a fallout spot, and we'll have to roast for 500 clicks at the very least. Your guys brought a bunch of maps, but there are no really safe areas on any of them. I had hopes for Lake Baikal, but... Still looking for Baikal. The archive is trashed. As for the radiation, that's what the filters are for. Keeping the dust out. Filters. All the carriages are so radioactive, no filters will help us without the green stuff. There will be children too. You have a son yourself, so you know children need more. I know. Do we have enough? Not for everyone at once. First we'll evacuate the core people, prepare clean rolling stock, and then bring everybody else out. So you mean we're going to split people into sorts? The ones we say first, and then the rest... You know what's drinks? at stake. Our children among all else. What's there to discuss? <laughs> Didn't expect that from you of all people. Think about Kirill. I for one thought about him. You two will be leaving with the first train. So don't fail me now. Just forget it all and take a break. Your people can handle the prospect by themselves. All right. <sighs> I want another smoke. How about you? Yep, go ahead and give me that smoke. See, I'm trying to... There we go, yep. Don't mind if I do. Help yourself then. It's been a while since I had smokes like this. The dirty stations are crawling with troublemakers. You know the sort. They've been rambling about doing away with the regime and starting a new life. And they're going to catch the day. Exactly. As soon as it becomes known that we've no green stuff left, and then the rumors of evacuation start. And they will. Naturally. Exaggerated ones at that. The leadership is running away, abandoning the common folk. A chance they won't miss. Well, you understand it all. We'll uphold order for as long as we can. God save us from a full-blown uprising. Still, God favors the prepared. Keep your weapon ready, Slava. We're in for one bumpy ride. <sighs> yes, this is going to get ugly. But we don't have a choice in this. Either we save who we can, or we descend into chaos and all die. So if you do have to shoot, look at this as a war on leaving the dead. Each rioter is an animated corpse trying to drag us into its grave. A cynical view. Cynical, but realistic. But Toby doesn't go that far. Are your people ready to do their part? Well, those who weren't all dropped out years ago. What's your take on the others? I'm not sure about some of them. We'll start quietly disbanding and disarming their units. You are risking splashing fuel on the embers. What else can I do? Damned if I do and if I don't. True enough. You know, I do feel drained. I guess I'll excuse myself. Of course. Have some rest while you still have a chance. I fear you haven't got long. And Slava, take care. Okay, Let's see what we're up against now. Can I go up in here? No, still can't. Okay. So, Let's exit. Well, he said they understand our predicament and they value our contribution and cooperation. Hello, sir. Come on. How's that the is? situation, sir? Come on. <laughs> How can you do this to us? Karma, please, tell them to do something! Please, Colonel, tell them to start handing it out! We can't wait anymore! Colonel, sir, permission please to address. Please stay calm. They'll be starting soon. Oh my god. Granted. An anonymous tip on excess stock. 
We can't ignore those. But he won't open the door. I see. Let's go. What the hell is with you? Hey, I feel like you like me a lot. Watch what you touch, soldier boy. I <laughs> just remembered the New Year. Didn't we have a here! Right over Come here? over here, sir! You remember? Of course I do. Open up, Petrovich! Slava! Uh, coming. Thanks. Mikhail Petrovich, you know why we are here. I suggest you donate your excess stock voluntarily, or there will be trouble. I can't? You know I can't do that. It is for my granddaughter. I have been saving from my own allowance. I can't do anything. We had a tip about your stock, and had to react to that. Commence the search. Check there. But this is so unfair. I earned this. Saved my wages. Oh my god. I know, but it we was followed the rules. Honest. I found the cash suit. He does have some. I cash Not too much here, though. My granddaughter is sick. She needs that. Sure, your granddaughter. I bet it's going to the market. Colonel, tell them, please. You know it's true. Sir, this can't be all he has stashed. We should search more. There's a quota to me. Uh, how do we choose that? These controls are very finicky. It won't let me do it. Enough debating. Resume the search. Yes, sir. Excess stock. First you stop paying us, and now our savings are excess? She won't survive without this. Can't you understand? Don't appeal to pity. There are no exceptions from the rules. We have orders. Pity? You pity no one. You are a snake, not a man. There's a whole bunch here. How did he get so much? Good. So the tip was correct after all. You bloodsucker. You took everything from me, took a child's life, and now you gloat. You just killed her. And she is friends with your Kirill, for Christ's sake. You keep Kirill out of this, you bastard. Grandpa! Grandpa! Watch out, the girl! Where did she come from? It's too funny, Grandpa! Please. Give him first aid and fill out the papers. I'll come for the goods later. Enough is enough. Your quota wasn't conjured. Okay, I guess that's it. it was calculated properly, Can I go? Oh no, shot. we gotta go this way. Pay the rest. Let's head out. I love it how they get around this game. It's kind of cool. Uh, I need to go here. So that. So I guess these people are just living under the city now. Kind of sucks. Huh. All right. So we made it this far. Let's see what happens. Oscom, open up. Ah, oh, hello there, Private. I'm completely drained. Kirill? Hmm. All right, Private. Tell me what's going on. Nothing. I just don't want... You don't want what? To be a Private! And I don't want to be an Oscom anymore! Right. Please, elaborate on that. I want to see Biraskaya. And I saw the soldiers taking green stuff from people. I mean, one traitor, when I give it to them, started shouting. They beat them up and took all the green stuff anyway. Well, this is just unacceptable. First thing tomorrow, I'm going to get their names. You said Oscom protects people, but you just take their green stuff away. Why? You're right. The situation is dire. Everyone's on edge. People don't want to share their green stuff. Some even attack the soldiers. That traitor started shouting, and they thought he could attack them. It's all a misunderstanding, don't you see? <sighs> that was a pretty extreme misunderstanding. The man's barely alive! That's his fault. When the authorities demand something, you must comply. Well, they demanded his last green stuff. But, yes... 
I know they were on duty. Great. Speaking of things we must do, it's high time we gave you a shot of green stuff. All right. Done. Kirill, Miller here. Do you read? Over. I read you, Colonel. There's some static. Over. I hear static too. I'm entering Sibirskaya. Was this where the last battle happened? Over. Yes. I only know of it from Father's words. Right before the rioters started their last attack, we had to talk. Dad, do you really have to go? We didn't rest at all. The rioters are advancing. There's no time for rest. Rioters? Tell me, Dad. If we, Oscar, are protecting people, why lie to them? Wow. You've grown up, Private. And I'm none the wiser. So let's have a grown-up talk. Should we tell the truth? Of course. But life is a complex thing. In the hands of our enemies, truth may be dangerous. We must carefully choose who we can entrust with it and who we cannot. The command sees the whole picture and makes decisions. However unpleasant those decisions might be sometimes, they are still necessary. The command thinks about everyone, while the civilians only think about themselves. That is why the truth that might scare them must be kept secret for their own good. Do you understand that? I do. But still, this is a scary way of thinking. There are a lot of scary things in life. Yet, I brought you up well. You are strong and brave. You can take it. All right, time to go. You get home and don't step out or let anyone in until I'm back. It's an order. Yes, Colonel, sir. Sergeant, walk him home. Yes, sir. Let's go, Kirill. All right. Good luck, Dad. Good luck, son. All right, so it looks like we got an assault rifle now, but I tell you what, uh, I think I am going to go ahead and cut it off. Let me see. Do I save it with F5? Quick save. Yeah, I think it's F5. All right, guys. Uh, so I think that's about it. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. I got work in the AM and I'm in the sales department. So yeah, it's going to be hell. We're busy for Labor Day weekend. And it's going to trail off into the week day. So I got a long day ahead of me. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them in the comment section. And uh, with that being said, thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoy my content, smash that like button like a Uzi like this. <laughs> I'm just kidding, y'all. But uh, look, if y'all want to go ahead and uh, hit me up on Instagram, it's Explore with Rick, or hit me up on YouTube, I would greatly appreciate it. If y'all have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comments. Like I said before, it feels like I'm repeating myself. But anyways, have a good night, and uh, take care. Bye.